Hello there, coming up on Cardiff Live, we'll be asking the people of Cardiff if they'll be celebrating the online trader Amazon's 25th birthday. But first, an extra cash boost has been given to South Wales Police to help tackle knife crime. In May, the Home Office allocated £1.2 million to the force in a bid to make the region safer. The money is being used to extend the Op Skepta knife crime team in Cardiff and create a new team in Swansea to focus on reducing knife crime on the streets of South Wales. Now, cash will also help fund preventative community-based work with young people as well, which will be targeted operations and back office functions to keep the Op officers on the streets. Officers working undercover and in uniform, stocking cars, stopping people, tackling those who bring knives onto the streets. Next, a 42-year-old man from Riverside, Cardiff, has been arrested on suspicion of a commercial burglary. Police CCTV operators alerted officers to someone smashing the shop window at around 5am Friday morning and the suspect was arrested within 15 minutes. He is in custody and a number of designer items have been found as well. And finally, the number of people complaining to Cardiff Council on social media about rubbish on the streets of Cardiff is increasing. Waste from green recycling bags has been strewn across many streets in what people have described online as disgusting and highly embarrassing for the capital. Cardiff Council are now asking all residents to use the facilities provided, especially the food waste recycling and to wash out recycling materials before they are put into their green bags. If every resident in the city did this, the bags would not be ripped open by animals or birds, the council has said. There we are then, you're watching Cardiff Live. Stay tuned to keep up to date with your local stories.